name's Christy Matthews from the Jones Farm Radio Group, and today I'm going to be reading The Rabbit Listened. Get your listening ears on. One day, Taylor decided to build something, something new, something special, something amazing. Taylor was so proud. But then, out of nowhere, all those birds, things came crashing down. The chicken was the first to notice. See the chicken? Cluck, cluck, what a shame. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry this happened. Let's talk, 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 talk about it. Cluck, cluck. But Taylor didn't feel like talking, so the chicken left. Next came the bear. Grr, roar! How horrible! I bet you feel so angry. Let's shout about it. Grr, arr, grr! It's pretty mad, isn't he? But Taylor didn't feel like shouting. Nope, so the bear left. The elephant knew just what to do. Da -da -da, I can fix this. We just need to remember exactly the way things were. But Taylor didn't feel like remembering, so the elephant also left. One by one they came, the hyena. Hee hee, let's just laugh about it. The ostrich, gulp, let's hide and pretend nothing happened. The kangaroo, tisk tisk, what a mess. Let's throw it all away. And the snake, let's knock down someone else's mess. But Taylor didn't feel like doing anything with anybody. So eventually they all left and Taylor was all alone. In the quiet, Taylor didn't even notice the rabbit, but it moved closer and closer until Taylor could feel its warm body. Together they sat in silence until Taylor said, please stay with me. The rabbit listened. The rabbit listened as Taylor talked. The rabbit listened as Taylor shouted. The rabbit listened as Taylor remembered and laughed. The rabbit listened to Taylor's plans to hide, to throw everything away, to ruin things for someone else. Through it all, the rabbit never left. And when the time was right, the rabbit listened to Taylor's plan to build again. I can't wait, Taylor said. It's going to be amazing.